Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we are going to construct a basic 3D model in Autodesk Inventor software and learn how to make a honeycomb pattern in Autodesk Inventor. So let's get started with today's tutorial. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and go to create. Now go to 2D sketch and select the exit plane this will be the top plane rotate the view now go to rectangle command and take two point center rectangle from this center point construct a rectangle now go to dimensions here the horizontal dimension will be 100 mm and the vertical dimension will be 55 mm okay now okay do one thing go to fillet take a fillet of radius 10 mm select these edge similarly select all the four edges and give radius 10 mm okay now finish this command now finish sketch and go to extrude command here take extrude of 25 mm and ok now we will make a round profile here so go to fill it select this bottom face and here give radius 7.5 mm and apply ok now this will look like this I'll show you now go back to home now we will shell this profile so go to shell here take a thickness of 2 mm and select only the top face it will remove the top face and make a thickness of 2 mm and ok now for this profile we will make the stopping face so go to plane Go to offset from plane and select this face. We want a plane this side. So here give the dimension minus 5 mm. So plane will be made at minus side and ok. Home. Now select this plane. Go to create sketch. Now go to rectangle command and take two point rectangle. Here construct a rectangle profile, go to dimensions, this width will be of 7.5 and this will be of height 1.5 m, ok. Now go to vertical constraint, select this midpoint and select midpoint of for part, ok. Now similarly we will make a horizontal profile here, go to rectangle command once again, take two point rectangle, select this inner edge, drag it, go to dimensions, this will be 7.5 and this dimension will be 1.5 m, ok. Now go to horizontal constraint select this center point the green point and select this yellow point ok now we want to mirror this at this side and this profile at this side so go to line command here switch on construction and make vertical line over here escape similarly go to line again and make a horizontal line here ok now go to mirror command or first select this yellow projected line and make it construction geometry. Similarly select here make it construction otherwise this will also mirror. Now go to mirror command select this profile go to mirror line and select this mirror line apply done ok. Again go to mirror command, 
select this profile go to mirror line and select this line apply and done ok now finish sketch and go to extrude command here make it normal drag this window it will select all the profiles we want extrude downwards so flip the direction and take here dimension 1.5 mm and ok these are the stopping face for this grill ok now select this face go to create sketch and go to project geometry select this inner profiles one by one ok radius this edge and this ok now finish sketch now go to extrude command here take extrude of 2 mm and we will not take the join here we will select new solid so this part will be separate from this and ok to check the solid here you can see it is showing two solid bodies open this so this is solid 1 and the new part is solid 2 now select solid 1 right click and turn off its visibility now we, work, we will work on solid 2 you can hide this working plane select this and turn off the visibility now select this face go to create sketch now we will make the honeycomb pattern from here go to polygon make a polygon of 6 sides go to dimension this dimension will be 8 mm and from center this will be at 9.5 mm ok now go to vertical constraint select this point and select center point ok now go to horizontal constraint select this point and select polygon center point now it is fully defined escape select this project geometry make it construction and here select this line edge and go to project geometry and select here and make it construction this is reference for doing the pattern now go to line command or first we will make the pattern go to rectangular pattern select this go to direction 1 here we will select this edge reverse the direction here take center to center distances 9.5 mm and the count of 13 ok now press ok now go to line command make a line from center point to this center point ok now escape select this line and make it a construction geometry this is also a reference line for making pattern now select this whole profile go to rectangular pattern and select this line go to direction 1 and select this line now you can see this will be the direction of honeycomb here take count of 4 and the center to center distance of 9.5 m ok similarly go to rectangular pattern once again select this profile go to direction 1 again select this line this time we will not go upward so go to flip direction take count of 4 once again and the center to center distance of 9.5 mm ok and ok now go to 3d model and select extrude command 
we will make take it normal we will make a complete window here and select all the profiles go to home view as you can see it is extruding upward but we want a cut profile so from here change to cut now it is cutting the profiles and ok ok this will be the final profile now select this sketch and make it visible go to top plane rotate now go to 2d sketch and select this working plane 1 on this we have made this rotate and go to project geometry select this profile once again complete sketch one by one this profile this and this finish sketch and select this sketch and turn off the visibility now only this profile is left which we have projected now now double click this and go to offset select here right click and here select loop selection now it will select loop at once drag it inside and take a thickness of 1.5 m ok escape here double click this and again write 1.5 finish sketch to home now go to extrude command and select this inner profile ok now as you can see it is cutting the profiles but here we want to join so select join and the distance will be of 2 mm ok ok so this will be the profile it is like a mesh now we will see the whole profile so go to solid one select right click and here select turn off the visibility ok now here cut profile is missing so you can hide solid to right click turn off the visibility now go to 2d sketch and select the stop face go to rectangle command and select two point rectangle select this outer edge and select this outer edge go to dimensions here give dimension as 15 mm and here also dimension 15 mm ok now go to 3d model go to extrude reverse the direction to cut and take a distance here at 15 mm ok and press ok now go to fillet command and here take radius 7.5 go to edge selection select this edge this edge and this bottom edge and this bottom edge and apply <coughs> ok now here change radius to 0.5 mm go to edge selection select this outer edge and select this inner edge and apply exit ok so this will be the profile now go to solid 2 right click and turn on the visibility now you can assign the color I have taken here red and this is yellow so go to so select solid 2 from here select red color I will take light red and for this go to solid 1 from here select you can select here at bottom yellow color ok so this is the profile so this is a basic tutorial to how to construct a honeycomb pattern in Autodesk Inventor
I hope you like the video. If you do that, please do hit like and subscribe the channel for more such videos. Thank you.